Welcome back to Flying Duke. In this video, we will look into one of the most magnificent and fascinating aircraft that rules the skies while soaring high. It is one of a kind. Seat backs in their upright positions, tray tables, armrests, safety belts, etc. Let's go. The Scorpion jet from Textron Aviation is like no other. It is not your everyday aircraft. Imagine a puzzle piece that fits a special spot that no other piece can. Textron Aviation decided to make this extraordinary jet because there was a job to do that no other plane could handle. They were supremely confident and used their own money to develop and create it, which is an unheard of departure from how most military planes are made. Also, the jet can be made right here at home in the USA, and then sent to countries all over the world. And guess what? It costs a fraction of those more expensive F-16 planes. The Scorpion can do a lot of important jobs like watching borders, keeping oceans safe, stopping illegal drugs, helping during disasters, and even fighting against rebellions. It might not have all the fancy stuff that super expensive fighter jets do, but that's one reason why it's so impressive and special. A group called Project Airland Enterprises LLC, or Airland, had a big dream of creating a brand new kind of aircraft. These secret investors wanted to make a super affordable jet for tactical missions. In 2011, they approached Textron, and they said, let's work together and make this idea real. And so, in just half a year, they started making the Scorpion in secret. They called the secret plane SCV-12-1, or simply, The Project. The special team of smart designers and engineers from Textron, Cessna, and Bell Helicopter joined forces working secretly in a classified development space. They had to keep everything hush-hush and made quick decisions because they believed that expediency was vital to success. They wanted to create, fly, and sell the plane as quickly as possible. And while they were creating this clandestine game-changer, they had to be careful not to let other companies know. They used secret agreements, local suppliers, and the close-knit community of Wichita, Kansas to keep everything mysterious. They were meticulously diligent to boot. They used parts and technology they already had, like things from Cessna and other easy-to-find pieces, to make the plane even faster. They were like a team of secret agents building an amazing secret jet. Even though they were in a hurry, there was still one big challenge, finding the right buyer. Think about it like this. There was a puzzle piece missing in the world of military planes. Textron noticed this because making planes was costing a lot more money and there weren't many affordable options. So they thought, let's make a plane that fits right in the middle. This new plane, the Scorpion, would be like a bridge between cheaper planes and the super expensive attack jets. Textron realized there was a need for this kind of aircraft. They had a plan to sell it to the US National Guard and other countries too. But here's the twist. Instead of the usual way of making planes based on very strict rules, Textron did a deep study to figure out exactly what these groups needed. They wanted to make sure their plane could do things others could not. Normally, it takes decades to make and test a new plane but Textron's team was on a mission. Even though they thought it might take around four or five years, they pulled off something incredible. They managed to design, build, and action a plane and have it flying within just two years, a true miracle of aviation. Here's a story that's a bit different. Think of it as a daring adventure in creating planes. They started working on the outer shape of the plane in May 2012, but the wings came into picture later around August. This means they had already begun to test the plane in the wind tunnel only moments after they had started work on the wing parts. And then, after everyone was sufficiently excited, the first plane model from Cessna was shown to the powers that be on September 16th, 2013. It was almost time for its very first flight. Now, let's dig a bit deeper into what this plane is all about. The Scorpion plane was designed to be light and made of special materials, kind of like a superhero among planes. 
It was supposed to be the perfect option for smaller countries that didn't have big budgets for expensive planes. At the start, they thought about making the plane with just one engine, but they had a gang of geniuses who took a look at different designs and they decided on something special. A two-seater plane where the seats are one in front of the other. Even though there were two seats, one pilot could fly this alone. They made sure it had a spot at the front to put cameras and sensors, but they could hide them when they weren't needed simply to make the plane faster. Now the piece de resistance is how much it costs. You won't believe it. They say it only costs $3,000 to fly this plane for an hour. That is significantly less than other similar planes. It's not only cheap to fly, it is also cheaper to buy and use compared to many of the other planes used for similar conflicts and mission directives. Each of these planes costs less than $20 million, which is even less than updated older planes like the A-10 or the F-16. They were thrifty and economically smart too. They actually used parts that you could find in stores, like when you build something from a kit. This Marvel is powered by Honeywell TF3 731 turbofans, usually found in business jets. These engines aren't just efficient, they are budget friendly and easy to maintain. A new era of aviation was dawning. The Textron Airland envisioned a market hungry for up to 2,000 Scorpion jets. The saga continued with rigorous tests, and after taxi trials in late 2013, the Scorpion soared into the skies for its maiden flight on December the 12th. Within a mere 23 months of conception, this airborne marvel defied the norm. Rigorous testing spanned two more years, ensuring perfection in every detail. Economical brilliance defined the Scorpion's essence. A mere $3,000 per hour of flight is a testament to its efficiency. Procurement was equally alluring at just under $20 million per aircraft. An ingenious approach employed readily available components, the very embodiment of cost-conscious ingenuity. Behold the Scorpion itself, a lightweight sentinel embodying elegance, form and function. Suited for both light attacks and reconnaissance, it's a sentinel of the sky, safeguarding smaller nations. Born as a single-engine concept, it evolved into a tandem-seat twin-engine configuration, a hallmark of strategic versatility. Its purpose was underscored by its adaptability. Hidden compartments housed surveillance gear, streamlining the aerodynamic prowess. Yet further secret innovation was at the heart of this journey. Agile, nimble and fierce, the Scorpion proved its mettle in every test. For its mechanical and electronic prowess, each test flight was a testament to engineering excellence. Progress was unrelenting. By April 2014, 50 hours of flight over 26 missions had been recorded, scaling heights of 30,000 feet at speeds of 490 miles per hour. Its dexterity was highlighted in maneuvers and stall speed remained steady at under 100 miles per hour. Delving into its extraordinary capabilities, it's not just an aircraft, but a strategic partner. Its modular design allows for swift adaptation, making it a precision tool in the arsenal of any air force. Its versatility shines, serving in light attacks, reconnaissance and simply patrolling. Moreover, it sports an internal payload capacity of 3,000 pounds and an additional 3,000 pounds external across six hardpoints, making it a lightweight powerhouse in the sky. The narrative culminates in one pivotal moment. A simulated chemical spill unveils its true prowess, transmitting vital data to the US Air National Guard. Mission success was astounding, 100%, cementing the Scorpion's intelligence and reconnaissance capabilities. The horizon beckoned, with global interest from nations like Malaysia and the Philippines and beyond. Amidst the changing times, the Scorpion remained a steadfast beacon of excellence. In a world of alternatives, it is unique in range, endurance and sensory detection. In short, the Scorpion is not just a plane. It's a testament to aviation evolution, an embodiment of excellence soaring into the future. 
Thank you for watching. Let us know your thoughts about this video in the comment section below. And don't forget to like and subscribe to keep enjoying more of our content. Also, ring the bell for notifications to stay updated. Until next time.